Hi everyone, sorry but it's me again, two videos in one day. I either don't do something or you end up with two in a day. Um, yeah, my lipstick and everything's changed. I've had a cup of tea and now I'm looking all hot and flustered. Um, so I'm just coming on to show you my subscription from Dina's Home of Crafts. Um, sorry, I've just got to sort my nose out. Um... It'll be my last subscription from her. Nothing wrong with Dina at all. It's just, I mentioned in the other video, really want to sort my credit card out because that's got a bit of a mess again. Crumbs. Oh, I look all podgy here. Mm. That's the joys of having a short neck. Um, yeah, so this is my last subscription from Dina. I've um, shown a lot of times before the link so if you want to find her on Etsy, it's Dina's Home of Crafts. I'll try and remember to link to it, but if I forget, just let me know and I'll do it as a pinned comment. So, oops, this is all her info. And then there's a couple of shows coming up that she's put in. So Spring into Wool, and this is a grammar school at Leeds, the 1st and 2nd of April. Uh, it's got tickets and stuff like that, so that's a show that's going on, too far from me. And then there's Summer Wool Fest, which is at Redbourne School, Amp Hill. So there's that one if anybody wants to go. And then let's see what she's written about this month's... I didn't bring my glasses back in, I was prepared for the last one. Uh, thank you for ordering the mystery box. The days have finally gotten a bit longer and it's been so nice to leave home when it's already light and came home when it is still light. This month I'm dreading... I'm dreading beasts from the east. Every weather news provider promises one very soon. Are you prepared with extra yarns and projects? I'm very well and with two crochet jumpers, blanket and a couple of socks on needles. Um, theme of the month, Beast from the East. So that sounds interesting. Um, yeah, we haven't had this bad weather they keep on about. So there's a little bit of rustling. Oh, that's different. Not had a grey um, yarn before. She normally puts on the back of the stitch marker what it is. Uh, so it's February Club, 75% Superwash Merino. 25% nylon and they're 20 grams and this is the little stitch marker for this month which is rather cute a little silvery one so I can see where she's gone with um beasts from the east with the um grey so we've got this grey one and then there's this mottled one with flecks of oh yeah that's quite pretty I um, don't know if you can see it too well, but it's just got like little flecks of the, almost of this in it. And then lastly, there's a minty one. It's not as bright as that. It's a lot more pale. I don't know if I can, no, it's not showing up. It's not as bright as this. It's a lot more pale and that's got like little flecks in it. So that's those three. I mean, I will be getting um, yarn again, but at the moment I just want to take a break, use up what I've got. So I'll be mixing these in with the Valentine one I've got with that. Um, it was going to be a blanket. It might still be. I might just keep it to one side until I get some more, think of the word, more pennies. Because I would prefer it as a blanket rather than a chunky scarf. So that would go on the back burner until I can get some more. Um, but yeah, I'm loving that. Very different. Because I certainly wouldn't have picked up those two, this definitely, because it's my colours. Um, yeah, so that is my little um, haul from Dina. Um, like I said, my last subscription. So I've got no more subscriptions. I have got a mystery box of yarn coming from Etsy. And I think that's it. So I will keep you posted with everything. And yes, thanks for joining me twice today. Bye.